If you have watched videos of Matt's off-road recovery, then you've probably seen many people just appear and disappear time and again. So you might be wondering about all the people who feature in the video. Are they family members or just someone Matt picks up along the way? How does he get so many people to come at a moment's notice? Well, as far as we can tell, the people that appear on the channel are mostly a mix of family members and friends, as well as his company's employees. So they sometimes appear in the video just for fun and to help Matt out. However, in the process, there are also those who used to generally appear on the channel but have left the whole Matt's off-road recovery sometime later. The reason for their leave varies, but what they have in common is that they don't have bad blood with Matt. So even though they have left Matt's crew, they're still on good terms with each other. With that out of the way, here are some notable members who have left Matt's off-road recovery. Rudy. First up on our list is Matt's own son, Rudy Wetzel. He used to appear in the videos quite often, but in April of 2022, he decided to go his own separate way and made his own separate YouTube channel called Rudy's Adventure and Design. If you want to know in detail why he made this decision, you can check out the whole video posted on the Decent Garage channel. But basically, he says that the opportunity came where he could branch out on his own and he took that opportunity for his personal growth. He also wanted a platform to tell his own story and some other off-camera issues. But since Matt's off-road recovery was putting around three videos a week, it didn't leave a lot of time for doing his own thing. So that was his reason for leaving the Matt's off-road recovery. It did work out well for him and his decision paid off since he now has over 226,000 subscribers on his YouTube channel and he's doing well for himself. Casey. However, the same level of success cannot be said for Casey, who similarly decided to go on a YouTube journey of his own. Casey created his channel on June the 25th, 2007, long before Matt's off-road recovery, and he used to post short random videos and didn't have that much traction on the channel. But on February the 20th, 2020, he started making videos related to towing and off-road recoveries, with the first video entitled, Ford Escape Rollover at Sand Hollow. Since then, he has uploaded videos consistently on his channel and has over 54.7 thousand subscribers and gets views in tens of thousands. Although no one has officially given the reason for Casey disappearing from Matt's off-road recovery, we don't have something solid to make a conclusion for his leaving. But interestingly, one of the viewers pointed out on Reddit that Casey's YouTube channel used to be Casey Lofthouse but shortly changed it to Casey's Off-Road Recovery after Matt started his channel. Casey also refers to his channel as C-O-R-R, -R, similarly to Matt calling his channel M-O-R-R. -R. Trevor and Skeeter As for Trevor and Skeeter, it was announced by Matt himself at the end of one of the videos that they moved on. He further added that they were not fired and that they're all on good terms. However, he didn't say what they were doing after leaving out of respect for their privacy. Randy But the same is not the case for Randy. He said that he was let go by Jeff in March of 2021. If you don't know who Jeff is, then let us clear the viewers that Jeff is the nephew of Matt and a 16-year service veteran of the US Armed Forces. It seems like Randy has also made a YouTube channel of his own, though it has been three months since his last upload. So it's fair to say that he isn't planning on focusing on his YouTube as of now. And that's it for this video. What are your thoughts on these former members of Matt's Off-Road Recovery? Please comment and let us know your thoughts. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel if you enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more.